So that's why I enjoy life is because I can have chocolate like this. This tastes so familiar. It tastes like a chips that you get in South Africa. A little bit psycho. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be all about food, which is awesome. I mean, who doesn't like food? But I'm Christelle. If you're new to my channel, I recently moved to Amsterdam from South Africa. I'm living abroad now um, permanently. And yes, this YouTube channel is basically just me and my life, what I do on a day-to-day, -day, weekly basis, how I adjust to living in Amsterdam and literally just my life and also while I am working a full-time job here in Amsterdam but yeah so welcome to everyone please subscribe to my channel and give this video a like if you if you want to so I thought to myself every time when I go into the supermarket there's always food that I want to buy but then I'm like oh maybe it doesn't taste that good you know all that stuff and then Today I went out to Albert Heijn and just bought a lot of stuff that I usually saw that I one to take and I'm going to give it a try and see what it tastes like there's also stuff that I haven't seen before I've been like looking through the aisles today to see what I wanted to try it's a lot of food and um, but who doesn't like food and I'm very excited to film this video I have my oven on because I need to put this in the oven I already started opening it and then I'm gonna get straight into tasting all of this food and I'm really really excited so let's get into it. Okay, so just a nice filming. Okay, let's get into it. So I am going to try. There's some sweet bits and some salty bits. I'm quite hungry as well, so I really don't even know where to start. Um let's actually let's start with this Oreo. So I'm a very, very big fan of Oreos. Like yeah, it's like probably my most favorite um, cookie, biscuit, whatever you call them. So I saw these strawberry cheesecake ones that I haven't seen before. Um, there was quite a lot of flavors. There was brownies, uh, Oreo brownies, and yes. But I picked up this one. Mm, I can smell the strawberry. And it's just like pink inside. Let's taste. Mmm. Mm. Well, this is really nice. You can taste the uh, black part a lot, but you can. I won't say it's strawberry cheesecake. It says on the packet strawberry cheesecake, but it is delicious. If you like strawberry flavor, you would love this. Okay, so the Oreos, like, I can literally probably go through this whole packet, but this is delicious. Um, I'm excited also to try other flavors. Okay, let's go for this mix. This is, uh, ooh, what is it called? Snoop Mix from Rare Brand. It's pretty soft to see. So, I was also trying to taste that type of candy. So, let's give this a try. Ooh, this is what it looks like in the inside. Mm smells delicious like sweet heaven mm. this is also really nice it's actually not that sweet and also not that sour but it's um it's a really nice mm, fruity flavor mm. this is so good Mm, this one is sour. Okay, <clears throat> so this is also nice. I wonder if everything that I bought actually cost 28 euros. So not that bad and I'm not going to eat everything. I'm just going to take a bite out of everything. But this is really nice just to... My oven. This is a really nice snack to have if you like eating sweets. I actually, I'm so excited to try this. This is a protein raspberry and strawberry shake. So in South Africa, 
I love anything strawberry. That's also why I took the strawberry Oreos. But um, I used to like have a, a pink milky, like any strawberry shake, um, strawberry milk. And here you only get like yogurt flavored drinks. So I wonder if this will be yogurt or is it a milk? Not sure. And then also I want to excuse, I am just recovering from a cold. So my entire nose area might be a little bit blocked. So sorry if that is irritating you a bit. But let's give this a try. Um, I've been eyeing, the, eyeing this probably since I arrived in the Netherlands. It's definitely milk, not yo not yogurt. It's very bland. <laughs> but still nice. It's like almost like a double thick. So the milk inside inside is very thick. Like I would because it's milk and I love milk, I would probably drink a lot of this. Um, but it has like the raspberry strawberry flavor which is very nice let's try this chippy so they actually have a lot of chips but it's most of them are paprika flavor and I'm not the biggest fan of that so I uh, took this Lay's it is Lay's for pebbles so yeah this is the sea salt flavor oh this is so cool like, I don't know if you can see the shape of this. It looks very, like, crunchy. Wow. Mm. This tastes so familiar. It tastes like a chips that you get in South Africa. Wow. This is nice, and it feels like you're not eat eating anything because it... It finishes so quickly in your mouth, if that makes sense. And then it's gone. Um, yo, I'm trying to think now what chips it is. Like, uh, I know which ones. It's like these yellow ones. It's, it's this yellow um, chips. It goes like this. I'll put a picture up if I can find it, but it tastes exactly like that, and it's not very salty, but it's very nice. So this is a cast brick. I don't think I've had one of these before, um, but also one thing of me is I love, love, love cheese. Anything dairy, like milk, cheese, I just love. Okay, so it's just like a... Okay, so this is what this looks like. It's just like a pastry and it has cheese inside mm, 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 mm. this is really good it's like fluffy pastry mm. and it's like a cheesy sauce inside Give me anything pastry and I'm good. I'm in heaven now because I can just taste all the food that I wanted to taste. And yeah. So let's. I'm so hungry. <laughs> I just want to get to this bad boy down here. So next up is uh, Speculous Cookies. This is very, um, it's a very popular cookie in the Netherlands and they also have spread in this cookie and yeah, they have a lot of spread. So also in the future, I would love to taste all of the spreads. Um, yeah, let's try this. Oh my word. How cute is this? I thought it's like packed like that, but not. This is so cute. It's like a small, it's probably this small so that you can small and packed in this thing so you can take it to work or to school or wherever mm, this is the cookie and it has chocolate at the back wow now this is 
Mm. This is a really nice cookie. I wonder what it's made out of. Uh, I can see canals, I see um, cinnamon. It's almost like if you ever tried um, syrup waffles, that's also bought a syrup waffle chocolate. But if you actually try this syrup waffle, this tastes very similar, very, very similar. Um, so that's good. And another one of this sweeties. Okay. Mm. Now this is the chocolate that I bought, milk strip waffle. So based from this, I thought it is milk chocolate that tastes, that taste, my mouth is salivating from the sweet. That is a strip waffle flavor. Um, so let's give this a try. Mm. Wow. Mm. Oh my goodness. This is amazing. I don't know if you can see properly, but there's like actual strip of our pieces in the chocolate this is flipping amazing mm. I'm a weird new favorite chocolate so that's why I enjoy life is because I can have chocolate like this do you know also why I love it is Usually if I, like my most favorite chocolates are usually chocolates that has like a crunch to it. So it's a chocolate with like cookies in or rice in or some type of like, you know, it's just like the texture of it's like crunchy and so this is like the milk chocolate with the waffle pieces, pieces the strip waffle pieces and there's like cookie pieces and oh. That's really nice. Um, if you could ever try this, you need to. So this is called um, Ruimbrekis. So I think it's literally like almost like a dough with cream inside. That's what I think it is. Let's give it a try. Oh, super soft. Oh goodness, this looks amazing. Okay, let's give it a. <gasps> wow, this is. So fresh. Mm. Wow. 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 I'm trying to think if I had something similar in South Africa. I might have, I don't know. But it's like a, it's almost like a milk brookie that like a very soft version of a milk brookie that I've had on my channel before I think when my friends visited and then also the day we spent in um, Amsterdam as friends together I'll put the link the video up somewhere um, it's basically like a milk brookie that's super soft and fresh with like cream inside um, yeah so this is really nice so the next thing is I think it's almost like um, a sausage roll so I'm going to it's called is I'm not I'm gonna butcher this name but it's called Sausage and Bridget Sausage and Bridget and it's so funny because I'm trying to pronounce the Dutch words and even some of them are Afrikaans and then people will still not understand me so I'm definitely pronouncing this wrong but anyways I just cut it in half and you can see it's like a um, sausage roll so I'm just gonna try this piece mm. the sausage roll in there is very tasteful it's like a spice that they use but it's that 
that proper sausage roll taste that I'm getting. It's really delicious. Um, and I mean, the pastry here is just awesome. So the other thing that I'm going to try, which is going to be very odd for a lot of people, but it's going to be muesli. So I've had um, over times muesli before, but it was like a chocolate muesli. This one is a nut muesli. So one thing about me is I absolutely love cereal. My parents, my sister, my whole family knows like I can live on cereal. I, when I was younger, still in school and living at home, I would literally eat um, my cereal for breakfast and then for dinner again. And then my parents would be like, you can't eat breakfast for dinner. You can't eat cereal all the time. But I absolutely love, love cereal. And then also my sister would know, she always buys her muesli to eat like with yogurt. And she will always, always just take like this little bit of muesli with her yogurt. And then I always eat her muesli. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, so... I'm going to eat this and I eat mine with milk. I can see pecan nuts, some almonds, um, macadamia nuts, normal nuts, peanuts. So, wow, well, everything, I haven't tasted anything bad. It's amazing. So yet again, I love crunch, I love muesli, mm. this is just amazing. This that I'm having, a few in the um, oven, but it is basically, I've read up online, but it's basically like, um, can you see, so it's basically white bread with cheese and ham. Oh my goodness. So this looks delicious. It looks flavorful. A lot of like, so this is yellow couscous with falafel, um, a lot of herbs. I don't know if this is like goat cheese or feta cheese, but some kind of cheese or cottage cheese. Not sure. Then there's, um, what do you call those peppers? Pepper juice. This looks delicious. So I'm going to try this. Mm. Mm. <clears throat> wow. This is full of flavor. It's like a Mediterranean Mediterranean flavor. But let's try some of this cheese with the pepper. Wow. This is delicious. I'm definitely also going to buy this for a future dinner or something again. Let's try some of the falafel. This is amazing. Wow. So, I have tried all the food and if I have to say what was my favorite, obviously, I think the chocolate was most definitely my favorite I'm gonna take another piece basically everything because everything is so different like the cookies I will enjoy on a different time and eating the sweetie bits like this is nice when I edit a video the chocolate I can eat at any time this is so nice as a treat oh everything is just that's going to be it for this video for today i really really hope you enjoyed it i will see you next week with a new video and yeah bye bye oh. i need to take another bite of the chocolate